Well, an alert citizen helped Portsmouth police nab a man they say carjacked an 81-year-old woman at Walmart on Frederick Boulevard Monday. Well, police arrested 53-year-old Rodney Lee Scott early this morning, but not until he took them on a high-speed chase through the streets of one neighborhood. Tony Side's Lori Crouch has more. From his perch on the porch, people be speeding down here. They go real fast. Sean Jenkins is the ultimate backseat driver. There was one right here on the corner one night when I was asleep. All I heard was a tire screech and then boom. Tuesday morning, he heard from his bedroom. They stopped at this one particular spot and that's where the sign stayed at. And I was like, what's going on outside? What his mother saw. Went back here got in a bad, like a bad wreck or something back there and she was going in the back to go get something but she was on the front porch and the cops said to run in the house. In the parking lot next door, a cream colored Ford SUV tangled with an unmarked police vehicle. The end of a cat and mouse chase heard round the Parkview neighborhood. I said, well, where are they going? Because you can hear. Mm -hmm. And I heard them going down that way. But it sounded like they were taking a bunch of turns and then went down that way. Behind the wheel, 53-year-old Rodney Lee Scott. Detectives say he carjacked the vehicle from an 81-year-old woman in the Walmart parking lot less than 24 hours earlier. They're not going to grab a 6'5", 300-pound man. They're going to grab a little old lady because they're cowards. Scott was charged with eluding police and carjacking. He also was served with additional warrants for crimes, including grand larceny. We're told the victim hurt her head and arm. Police say she's doing okay tonight. In Portsmouth, I'm Lori Crouch, 10 on your side. Tony said also did some digging tonight and found out that Scott does have a criminal history in Maryland and in Northern Virginia.